Uh, yes, uh, so Manik Fan Sahib, you have explained things very clearly, and I think this is something which is which can be understood by any common man, as simple as that. Yes, yes. If you understand the basics, then it is as simple as that. So uh, I am surprised why, in your whole lifetime, you have been, uh, you are now more than seventy years. Seventy-nine. Yeah, you are. You are now seventy. Nine. Seventy-nine years. And you started this uh, uh, whole mission in which year? I I got the idea in sixty-five. Sixty-five. So six, something happened. Yeah, I know. Yeah, nineteen sixty-five till two thousand seventeen is how many years? You can count. Yes. How many years? How many years? Uh, I yes. Yeah, it is fifty-two years. So you have been uh, doing this work for last fifty-two years, trying yes. to uh, make people understand that how the calendar works, what is the importance of lunar calendar. But you have been part of an organization called the Hijri Committee of India, mm. and uh, uh, we see that they have turned themselves into a, a different sect altogether. Yeah. So, uh, um, and they, uh, I don't know how it has been uh, done, but uh, the whole organization has, I believe, that is not successful in uh, educating the public at large, especially the Kerala public, uh, um, because they themselves have been uh, um, uh, restricting themselves or uh, secluding themselves, turning into a watertight compartment of their own. Yes. So, now, what do you? How do you evaluate your life? like have you been uh, have, i believe that you have not been successful in uh, in in the sense that uh, making people understand at large numbers because it's so simple so what is the reason behind it the reason behind is you see when i came uh, here this kerala hilal committee was dealing with the subject and uh, they were following a calendar which was not correct when i studied that i found that they are calculating uh, the lunar calendar based on the kerala sunset and moonset which is not there in science scientific world is not knowing this method in science we have got a correct method of measuring the lunar month that is conjunction that is the moon is rotating around the earth and when it comes to the sun one cycle is complete the other begins this is the lunar month but these people are uh, wanting to see the hilal to begin the month so they were making mistakes and i wrote to them many letters and by that time uh, there was uh, some some confusion in the hilal committee that is what happened was these people were uh, mujahid group all these members of hilal committee is mujahid people so what happened was according to their uh, method of calculation it was not uh, eid but the sunnis declared eid then they didn't pray eid they prayed eid one day late this gave uh, rise to lot of controversies and these mujahids are less sunnis are more mm. then finally they said no no we should not quarrel with this with them this is only sunna we can join with them let them declare when they said this there was dispute in the hilal committee some group some people said no no we have come to calculate depending on calculation we must then why are we depending on sunni like that hijra hilal committee came mm. this hijra hilal committee also do not know what is the correct method of calculation they were also depending on this moonset sunset different this was caused by the rabita no, rabita only uh, informed all the institutions under them that they should calculate calendar basing of uh, on the sunset and moonset of their locality mm-hmm. this gave different calendars mm-hmm. this came into a controversy okay. and all this was started by dr elias method elias uh, he says he doesn't know the how to calculate this the ulama say that you have to see the hilal before beginning the month so he is computing the calendar based on that mm-hmm. the same way these people also are doing but here the difference is uh, the man who was calculating professor ahmed kutti i met him he says that our criterion is even if the moonset is 1 minute 
after this one, next day will be the first. For uh, calendar, calculation is necessary and there should be some rule. This is our rule. Then I asked him, is this rule correct? Then he said, I do not know about that. Mm -hmm. Because all ulama say that hilal should be seen. Yeah. It is not my decision, it is their decision, I can't say anything. So he has calculated like this. Now the confusion has gone so far as to say that hilal will not be seen with few minutes. It should be more than 48 minutes now. So the, the rule has changed again. Yeah. This is what is going on happening. And then I am between these people. These uh, Hira Hilal committee people uh, are also Mujahids. The Hilal committee people also are Mujahids. The Hijra committee people also are Mujahids. So they cannot blame Mujahids. So there is, they cannot say anything. And my voice has not come out of because of that. I am unable to go anywhere because they have branded me also as a rebel. Mm -hmm. This is what has happened. Now I have left them because they are not doing anything except doing it. For that only they are, they are not ready to learn also. Nobody has studied the subject under me properly. I cannot give such certificate to any one of these. Even, even Hijra Committee of India? Yes, yes. Nothing, nobody knows fully. Uh, is, there, is there anyone on the globe who knows fully what you say? Yes, astronomers know, but no. not Muslims. Okay. Yeah, Dr. Fazal was the only astronomer who had had the PhD from Edinburgh University. He was the astronomer in Saudi Arabia. He was the person who is responsible for making the uh, astronomical observatory and everything in Saudi Arabia. He made the Murkura calendar, but that was scrapped when some confusion arose. arose yeah. That was in 2000. Okay. After this, this uh, trouble is going on. Okay. So in Kerala, uh, do you have anyone uh, who can, uh, who can um, teach people well about this? Uh, there is no one. No one has studied the whole thing thoroughly, okay. you know. Okay. Thorough study of this is necessary. They should know how to measure the manazil. And Arabs were doing that. Yes. They had an instrument called... Uh, Rubul Mujayib, okay. and by that you can uh, measure the angle of the sun and moon and find out the date e exactly. So you mean to say that even Hijra Committee of India, of which you were the president, yes. uh, doesn't know uh, the entire uh, issue of uh, the Hijra, Hijra, Hijra calendar? Yes, but uh, you see I have taught them how to make the calendar. It's very simple. Mm -hmm. Data is available in the internet. We need only new moon data. New moon day is the last day of the Jirama, the lunar month. Mm. So anybody can do that. It's very simple. I've seen that you have uh, you, you your lectures or your detailed uh, teaching uh, are not available on the net as well. So uh, why is it that? Why is it that nobody so? has recorded that. Mm. Yes, because I have not been able to convey the message to the proper people, and we don't have people like you to record this. Sometime back, our Anis was Alwa. Mm. He was recording something, mm. but he also is not thoroughly understanding the subject. Okay. So let's hope that this whole effort will uh, go into the, the, the whole Muslim ummah of the entire globe. So we have been recording it this, this in English, though you yes. know 14 other languages. Yes. We have been focusing on uh, English language. So let's uh, hope that this recording and this whole documentation will reach the entire uh, global population. Inshallah, inshallah. And uh, this uh, it will be an encouraging thing for many of the peoples to come. Yes, inshallah. yes. Okay, thank you. Shukran. 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 Yeah. Alaikum. Alaikum.